Did you bring me anything? New parts? Last weekend's crossword puzzle? Preferably not already filled out this time. Captain, I must say, your thrilling management of the UDL troops at HRS-1084 was masterful to... Um... Remotely keep apprised of. Welcome back, Captain. How can I be of assistance? Goodbye. Lemon slap. Slap your whole family tonight. This is Halcyon News. We interrupt your regularly scheduled advertisement for the following stories. Forced in baked stories. beans. When you need to eat and run, forced in baked beans is the only Drop one. announced a breakthrough in weapons technology today. Their top scientists have developed... Finally, a base of our own. Soon we'll have eyes on every corner of the system. Well done, Captain. I heard about that. While my lawyers scratch their heads wondering how we deal with human salvage, I'm leaving the researchers in hibernation. Aside from the automated security, did you meet any resistance at the station? I knew it. They've been shadowing us since Monarch, maybe even longer. I've been less than honest with you. Your assignments weren't strictly about the salvage business. You might have figured that out already. That's right. Up until now, I've kept you in the dark for your protection, and more importantly, mine. But I'd like to think we've earned each other's trust. After the Monarch job, I started connecting the dots. I didn't like the picture. Then what we found at Station 1084 confirmed my fears. You and I have stumbled onto something big. Something none of us were meant to know. Maybe the worst. Ask yourself why a skeleton crew was studying that Alta Vitae gas in secret. Ask yourself why stockpiles were hidden on a planet full of monsters. But 
Before we go any further, I want you to keep an open mind. Can you do that for me, Captain? Aliens. I'm talking about aliens. They're the ones responsible for the deaths at 1084, and who knows what else. We have to put a stop to it. I knew it. Aliens from other worlds been visiting Halcyon. At least one of your crew can keep an open mind. But this isn't some Aetherwave serial, Millstone. This is reality. Hear me out. I'm saying it's aliens. I'm not asking you to like it. I'm not even asking you to believe it. But I need to act on this threat to the colony, and I can't do it alone. This doesn't feel at all right, Captain. Damn, she's serious. Tragic, ain't it? What age does to your mental faculties? The crew is skeptical. That's good. I don't want you walking into the unknown with blindfolds on. I assume you have questions? If we're gonna see this through, I'll need your trust and commitment. Now's the time for setting doubts aside. Conspiracy. One carried out with the help of human collaborators, assuming they haven't all been replaced. This is an invasion of our very cells. That damned gas is mixing our nuclein with Halcyon biology to twist us, change us, make us more like those monsters on Monarch. No kidding. That's how they want it. When I lined up the evidence in my spreadsheet, there was only one possible conclusion looking back at me. This is my data talking, not my anxiety or lack of sleep. If you don't believe me, Go pay a visit to the Puppet Master who's working against her own kind. Dr. Chartrand is the crooked psychopath behind the gas experiments. She sold out her species, and I need you to put a bullet through her skull. She's a research scientist and a damn good one. Before UDL poached her, she engineered a 0.2% increase in cysty pig juiciness. Now she's doing the same thing with humanity. Her fingerprints were all over Station 1084. You saw what she did to her team. They've got me all wrong. I just want to add Savior of Humanity to my resume. I've got ambitions outside of this office, you know. Besides, this way Sublight gets first dibs on Alien Salvage. You don't just turn down an exclusive deal on extraterrestrial scrap. That's amateur shit. Do you usually come across innocent people trapped in suspension tanks? Because some of us would call that excessive. Remember, the tanks were just the shit she left behind. Just imagine the experiments she carted off to her next lab. This keycard will get you through the front door of her Byzantium estate. Don't ask how I got it. You might not like the answer. By now, the other side knows what you're doing. Don't trust anything Chartran says. She's compromised down to the bone. Maybe even deeper than that.
MP pancake mix now requires no mixing. Seriously, this don't is mix. Halcyon News. We interrupt your regularly scheduled advertisement for the following story. Concerned citizens often ask why there aren't enough new faces in the Halcyon colony. We all want new neighbors from time to time. Our studies have shown that a controlled population is inversely proportional to consumer happiness. Fewer colonists means there's more paradise for the rest of us to enjoy. You're back. Not that I missed you. I assure you, I am not capable of such emotional capacity. 